And now, your first alert five weather. Welcome back. There's a live look at that thunderstorm out over northern El Paso County this afternoon. Not severe, but that thing is dropping down some pretty good rainfall here in the city. It's just plain old hot 89 right now at the airport. A south wind sustained at 19 miles per hour. That's live downtown Pueblo. Sunny, breezy and sizzling 95 degrees. Southeast breeze at the airport, 21 miles per hour. We're going to take you up to the hill. Cloudy skies, dry for all the commuters this afternoon. The uh, temperature sensor taking a little siesta, but that thunderstorm is just off to the east of the uh, monument area. There it is right there on radar. This thing is pulsing up once again. Not a severe thunderstorm, but I think we could be getting some penny sized hail out of that thing. You can see it's sandwiched right between Black Forest and Eastonville out of our open country, northern El Paso County. Not moving a whole heck of a lot. There is some dangerous cloud to ground lightning with that thing pushing south at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. Again, the biggest hazard is going to be the lightning with that thing, getting some good rainfall, but again, it's a very isolated area. Small hail possible with that thing. That is pretty much it. Tracking a little bit of shower activity off to the west of Fort Carson. A couple of uh, showers trying to get going there, and that's it. The rest of the News 5 viewing area is bone dry, and most of us will stay dry here for the rest of the afternoon through the night as well. Here's what the monsoon is doing right now. Most of that monsoon moisture being suppressed just to the south of our area, and a pattern change around here tomorrow. Very dominant ridge of high pressure is going to push in right on top of the state. It's going to bring in lots of sunshine as we work through your Saturday. And if you thought it was hot today, hotter still tomorrow and hotter still on Sunday. Now, another change in your forecast by early next week. Cold front's going to blast through here late Sunday night. By Monday, it's off to the southeast of us. We'll have a moist upslope flow at the surface and a loft will have a northwesterly flow. That's really a classic setup for severe thunderstorms here across the News 5 viewing area. I think they will develop over the higher elevations, make a push to the plains. Not everyone will get a severe thunderstorm Monday afternoon, but I've got them in your forecast already. Now, tomorrow, it's going to be a dry day. By mid-afternoon, 94 and 90 degrees across Colorado Springs and Pueblo. You can see even a lack of clouds as we work into the late afternoon into the evening hours. Most of us again dry across southeastern Colorado. Take a look at temperatures from border to border. It's hot across northern Colorado. Not to be outdone, not to be left out. Western Colorado hot as well. There's your hot spot in the state. Grand Junction right now at 96 degrees. Going to be pleasant overnight tonight. Mostly clear skies dropping to 59 in the Springs. Pueblo an overnight low temperature of 61 degrees. No other way to say it. It's just going to be painfully hot around here all weekend long. Temperatures tomorrow, 90s and triple digits, and it gets even hotter than that. Here's your super seven day forecast in Colorado Springs. Want to break out your day planner tomorrow. If you've got outdoor activities, going to be exercising, uh, running around town. You just need to stay hydrated, drink a lot of water, and use that sun sauce. We're going to see a high of 96 on Sunday. That'll miss the all time record high by just one degree. Here comes that cold front knocking us back only into the mid 80s. Again, severe thunderstorms possible Monday afternoon and Tuesday afternoon. Going to see a dry hot pattern again Thursday into Friday. Lots of sunburn sunshine. Pueblo with this forecast you start at 100 and end at 100. In between you're going to be really hot on Sunday missing the all time record high by just a couple of degrees. PM thunderstorms in the mix Monday afternoon and again Tuesday afternoon. Even in Pueblo you could see a severe thunderstorm both of those days for Canyon City. It's hot and it's here to stay. Triple digits on Sunday Monday, cooler Monday into Tuesday and then right back into the uh, flamethrower right there by Friday 98 degrees with mostly sunny skies. Woodland Park going to keep you dry tomorrow with thunderstorm possible late Sunday afternoon. Better chance of seeing thunderstorms Monday into Tuesday. Real pleasant those two days then back on the burner by Thursday and Friday mid 80s once again.